I'll fly a starship across the universe divide. All right, what's up, everybody? It's Brody Stapleton Outdoors here today. Today I brought out the Kiapa Little Badger for the second time, but today she's looking a little different. Jerry from Longshot Manufacturing was kind enough to send me a bunch of accessories for this gun, and today I'm gonna go over them and maybe shoot a little bit at some distance with this nice little bipod as well. All right, so the first thing I'm going to talk about is the thread protector. It's made out of machined stainless steel and it has nice spikes on there. I'd say mainly for looks. I don't know how useful those are going to be in a combat situation or if you're even going to reach for this thing if a home intruder comes in, but that's a really nice touch. It protects the threads and is way better than the factory one that it comes with. And next thing up, we got this front sight here. Um, it's really nice because it's adjustable right here and since I mounted this uh, Ruger rapid deploy rear sight that uh, it can't be adjusted for elevation so Jerry thought about that and made it so it's able to adjust up here so my sight is gonna be right on I sighted it in at about 25 yards and she shoots perfectly so this a uh, Nice upgrade from the factory site. Factory site was, I think, uh, poly some type of polymer, a weak plastic that I wouldn't really trust. Same with the back site. But the next thing he gave me was a, um, a machined aluminum top rail. And this is the full size top rail. So it replaces the back, the back site. And if you guys are thinking about putting an optic on this gun, this is gonna be a necessity because the, the plates that it comes with are flat and sit right on top of the receiver, but with these, they have a, they have kind of a rounded part, as you see right here, so it kind of grips onto the receiver so it can't move around if it ever loses, uh, loses a screw or gets loose or anything, so with a scope, that's going to be necessary, and the next thing is this forehand grip right here that replaces the three Picatinny rails that go on there, which makes it a lot more comfortable to hold, which is gonna be nicer if you don't have gloves. I usually don't wear gloves when I'm shooting, but um, if you're not gonna put a rail, or I mean a flashlight, or a, I don't, I don't even know what you'd put right here. If you're not gonna put anything on these rails, I'd recommend getting this way more comfy to hold on to while you're shooting. Next up, we have the barrel shroud. This is the the shorter barrel shroud from Long Shots, the newer one. It's not the long, full-length one, but this one has a option of putting a bipod on. It's kind enough to send me this bipod as well, and this is going to be nice for shooting off of uneven surfaces and having a nice rest. When even if you have these open sights, you're going to be accurate out to longer ranges, which I'm going to show you. I'm about to show you in a, a little bit. And the next thing we have is the we have the white machined aluminum hammer extension. So this is nice if you have a scope on here that's gonna protrude out to about here, you can still get access to that hammer really easily. Next thing up, we have the pistol grip. And this is a very, very nice addition. I think this might be one of my favorites. It kind of transforms the gun in a whole new way. You don't really have to hold it like this. You can just pick up the gun and you're right on target. Now with all these accessories it's not really you're not really giving up too much space it's going to be a little bit longer right here because of the front sight but everything else kind of fits up tucks away neatly but um you're gonna have a little bit more width because of this because of this bipod but nothing to really be worried about you can still slide it in a bag you just won't be able to fit it in the kiapa bag that it comes with all right guys, I got my redneck shooting rest right here. My little lifetime card table from Amazon. We're gonna test out this bipod and all these accessories from Longshot Manufacturing. Let's get the show on the road. All right, we're shooting 36 grain copper plated hollow points from Federal. And I think we're shooting 
at around 90 to 100 at a 8 inch plate. I sighted this gun in at 25 yards, but out at this range, I need to aim about 3 inches low to hit this target. So, there we go. Really steady off of this bipod. Really nice touch. All right, guys. All in all, this gun has served its purpose for me. Some people say it's a little bit too expensive, but from what I've seen, this gun is accurate, more accurate than I am. So as soon as I put an optic on here, I'm, I'm curious to see what the groups are going to be like out at distance. And so far, it's not had any failures to shoot it's been reliable and I can't really see anything wrong with it at all and all these accessories just add the likability all right guys I'm back at the house I'm about to clean the little badger don't forget to drop a like subscribe share the video with your friends comment if you have any questions or disagree with anything I've said and thanks for tuning in we'll catch you in the next video thanks for watching